forgot to talk about this Rambo, the new trailer. Anthony saw it. It's oh. on YouTube, I guess. He's doing another Rambo. Why wouldn't he? He made a deal. It was like, I'll, I'll do Rocky, but I want to do Rambo as well. well he, so Stallone wanted to do Rambo. Of course he did. What else is he going to do? What do you think it's... Um, He's injecting steroids. He's 60. He wants to, he wants to continue doing this. How many, oh, uh, how many Rambos? Three or four. How many Rambos were made? How many sucked all of them? They're three. Awful. Three Rambos. Three. What do you think he's going to call this? Rambo 4? That sounds too silly. What do you assume he would call this? Well, is he going to keep in the Rocky tradition and think that he somehow has dignity at his age by just naming the character, the movie, the original? It is John Rambo. Rambo. Coming to a theater near you. Yes. Look for future movies by a Sylvester Stallone. Uh, Raymond Tango <laughs> will be uh, one. Uh, Marion Cabretti. The sequel to be coming out soon. And, of course, uh, Freddie Heflin. <laughs> That's from Copland. <laughs> the guy thinks if you just name the movie, the character's name, that it wraps it all up and it kind of gives him, it lets him do this. And it's more artistic than it is just a sequel. That's it. I just need yes. to move on. Judge Dress. He tried to move on. Joseph Dredd. That was his name yeah, in that he, one. He tried to move on. No one was buying it, so now he's going back to, you know. Magistrate Dread. <laughs> Why can't he just do another character? We, we John it. Spartan. <laughs> <laughs> he tried, Jimmy. But he, Copland was great. It was great. Yeah. He, he I, I loved his character in yes. Copland. Be a if fat, anybody else idiot. was uh, beating down his door there. So what's uh, the Rambo trailer all about? And who's he fighting now? Um, is, he I fighting, believe... is he fighting his inner demons? Man. Yeah, man. <laughs> See, uh, apparently he's fighting the barber because he still has the mullet on his head from the 80s. And there's this uh, there's this Peace Corps group, I guess. Yeah. Some type of peaceniks. And uh, there's uh, some kind of uh, war going on in Bur wait, wait. Burma. Is the war... Uh... <laughs> Being fought inside his inner soul, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Where's the real war being fought? <laughs> it's not over. I didn't start this. I didn't draw for his blood. What? <laughs> it's in Burma. I was in Burma. Yeah, and uh, some kind of. But um, you know what? It's it's also in his head. <laughs> man. We all know the real war is being fought. <laughs> Rambo's head, man. Where the hell is Burma? Are we getting that safe? With I don't movies? know where it is, but wherever it is, you better bring a good supply of body bags. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. Burma? What the hell did Burma ever do to us? No, I, no one goes know. to Burma. But eventually, I think we talked about it on the show. We're just gonna have to like fight imaginary, uh, you know, uh, people from imaginary yeah. countries just to play it safe. Play it safe. The Here's the Burma. Uh, the reviews are in already. Yeah. It's over, Jenny. <laughs> It's over, Jenny. Yeah. It's over. Nothing is over. <laughs> Nothing. You just don't turn it off. Please turn it off. <laughs> I will. I will give myself a pat on the back. From the day that stuff started, mm -hmm. I despised it. Despised. I never liked Rambo. He's a cornball. Rambo is a cornball. He's got uh, a headband. Oh, he's still got it. Oh, he's awful. You Olivia Newton John, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> So what's the what's the trailer all about? Well, I haven't uh, seen it yet on on the video site. This group of people um, uh, somehow approach Rambo to help them out because the Burmese. There's, there's all kinds of problems in Burma. Wow, yeah. And uh, Rambo's just like uh, hanging bit, out. It's a hot bit of activity, huh? Burma. Yeah, <laughs> he's hanging out down there, and um, he doesn't want to get involved anymore. And he talks real low at the beginning, and just kind of you know, I don't do that. Right, right. Uh, and and some woman's trying to convince him, and and she can't convince him, and they go off, and they get taken prisoner. No. By the evil Burmese, I guess. Of course. Burmese. Uh, I don't know. And then uh, Rambo, of course, has to go in, and and free them. So Rambo goes in, and uh, one thing I must say, the the trailer I saw. More graphic violence than I've ever seen in any... This rivals Saving Private Ryan's opening scene. No kidding. It just is nothing but Rambo hacking people to pieces with machine guns, knives, and his bare hands. He pulls out some man's throat with his bare hand. <laughs> and this is just the trailer? Yeah. And then uh, he, uh, he jumps on the back of this uh, Jeep-type uh, vehicle. 
that has a mounted machine gun, spins it around to the driver, and at point blank range pulls the trigger, and you just see pieces of meat flying out of the driver's seat. Nice. So it's a lot more graphic than the original Rambo's were, even though, you know, when he shot that one guy uh, uh, with the arrow and he blew him out of his boots. Yeah. You didn't really see much, though. This one is just graphic, graphic Shot violence. Shot for everybody. Decapitations. Uh, he, he disembowels a guy with his Rambo knife. So uh, uh, it, it's a lot more graphic. If they keep that whole theme of just graphic violence, I think it might do all right. Is there any uh, catchphrases in the uh, in the trailer? Uh, not in the trailer. Uh, I, I didn't really catch any. Yeah. But uh, I'm sure in the movie there will be, please. You're going to have to bring one other thing. What's that? A swollen prostate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go to Cat in Jersey. Cat, what's up? Hey, how you doing? I just want to let you know that Burma is now called Myanmar. That's why you don't know where it is. Myanmar? Myanmar. Myanmar. What the hell is that? Hmm. Uh, it's like Burma. Indonesia, all that kind of stuff. Oh. All righty. So why is uh, it called Burma in in the because trailer? It, it used to be called Burma. So, you know, hardcore Rambo is still calling it Burma? Yeah, because, you know, he's old. Yeah, <laughs> okay. don't want to confuse people. Is it a hotbed of activity, this place? It is. Look it up. It's pretty violent. Yeah, I would assume. Yeah. Well, it's uh, India's to the left and uh, China to the right, and then you got Thailand kind of southeast. Right? It's just a kind of a area of the world there. And then you got a lot of conflict. Then you got the Bay of Bengal. <laughs> Bengal. To its uh, southwest. When you're in... Oh, wait, we got a catchphrase, Steve? Yeah. All right, what oh. is it? The catchphrase from the Rambo trailer is when you're pushed, killing is as easy as breathing. Oh, it's a little yeah. long for a catchphrase. <laughs> it really yeah. is. It's a catch paragraph. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> when you're pushed and you're tired and you've done your best, send Colin. Wow, that's uh, that's a little rough for a catchphrase. That's not going to be easy to put on a T-shirt. No. So, uh, all right, well. Uh, and it said uh, uh, John Rambo at the end of the trailer. And then it said attacking theaters soon. Ew. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah. She also attacked his agent and script supervisor. <laughs> <laughs> is there any, can we hear the trailer or is it, is it not worth playing because it's just... Is it mostly shooting? music probably? Yeah, I think it's, it's all mostly dramatic, uh, right. dramatic music and explosions and... Um, whoosh, oh! 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 And him, you know, doing a rock scream. <laughs> Rambo rock scream. Tuesday. Oh. All right. All right, we're not going to watch it. No, we're That's not going to not... watch a movie trailer on the radio. That's just plain silly.